Here are five things to know on this Tuesday morning. Police in Lewiston, along with Maine State Police, are investigating the death of a 17 year old boy in the city. State police officials say officers found Sahil Maridi laying in the street unresponsive on Rideout Avenue Sunday night. Investigators say Lewiston police responded to calls of shots fired on that street around 1030, which is when they discovered Maridi. He was pronounced dead at the scene. His mother told us she has no idea what happened to her son. Police also responded to two other shots fired calls in Lewiston over the weekend. Officials say there is no indication that anyone was injured in those other two shootings, but anyone with information is asked to contact Lewiston police or Maine State police. We are learning new details about a death investigation in Knox County. Maine State Police detectives were called to a home on River Road in the town of Cushing on Friday to collect evidence and conduct interviews. While investigators still haven't said anything about the person who was found dead there or how they died, they now do say that they've made an arrest. Mark Gagne is charged with hindering apprehension and abuse of a corpse. More than $600,000 in federal funding is going to the Presque Isle International Airport for upgrades. U.S. Senators Susan Collins and Angus King announced that funding yesterday. It comes from the Department of Transportation as part of the Airport Improvement Grant Program. Just over $611,000 will be used to help pay for a new ramp area to accommodate larger planes. Some of the money will also go towards maintaining the pavement on the runways. The summer day camp hosted by the City of Augusta Child Care Bureau is going to close early today and tomorrow. Staff say it'll be too hot to keep the kids inside, adding that even with AC, they wouldn't be able to cool the classrooms down enough to keep it safe. Staff say camp will close at noon today and tomorrow. And an athlete from Bowdoin College is heading to the 2024 Olympics. Swimmer Alex Grandpierre will represent Team Haiti. Alex will be swimming in the 100 meter breaststroke, which starts on July 27th, the day after the opening ceremony. By the way, Alex is the third Grandpierre sibling to swim for Bowdoin and represent Haiti in the Olympics. Oh, cool. We'll have much more on that story later this week. Yeah, that's that really is neat. so yeah. wild. Mm. Couple of hot ones, folks, and then we get relief. Hang in there. See ya.